Let's start phase four off with Black Widow. Probably don't need to say this, but spoilers ahead, so click that like button and come back later. I remember how hyped I was for this movie. It was originally supposed to come out on my birthday, May 1st today, but then COVID happened and it got to delayed a bunch. Fans and I have been waiting years to see a Black Widow movie, and it was so nice to finally see it. My favorite character of the film has to be Alexi. It was honestly really hard for me to choose between Alexi and Elena as my favorite character for this review, but I think I like Alexi more because his character stuck out to me. I love how he's just basically a Russian bootleg version of Captain America. Also, I really hope they have his character return for a Winter Guard movie. So this movie had one of the coolest but also the most disturbing opening inside the Marvel Universe. It's like you're jumping to a bunch of human trafficking children and forming the Red Room. But they also have this killer soundtrack behind it and all the kids actings in this scene were amazing. You just don't know rather to love this scene or find it really disturbing because this kind of thing happens in real life a lot, like human trafficking and all that. I just think it's cool that this movie tackled a serious issue like that. And I know a lot of people weren't the biggest fan of the Taskmaster reveal, but honestly, I didn't really mind it. Of course the MCU is going to make a few changes with these kinds of characters. And I really liked what they did here for her, because I was not expecting her to be Dracovich's daughter. What I really like about it is how, in some miraculous way or another, his daughter managed to survive that fire, and his first thought is, you know what, let's uh, put a mind implant in her and uh, make her our ultimate weapon. It really made me terrified of his character and showed me that he'll do anything to get whatever he wants, even taking the free will away from his own daughter. I also like some of the fight scenes in this too. Sure, some of them were weirdly edited together, but uh, they were still cool action scenes and I enjoyed them a lot. Especially the fight scenes with Taskmaster, those are just really fun fights to watch. I wasn't really the biggest fan on how they explained Natasha and Clint's past in this film. I kind of wanted them to go more in depth with more flashbacks on how they first met and first fought each other. Because movements was something that they were building up for years and I really wanted to see what happened between the two instead of them just talking about it. Maybe we'll get an animated series that goes more in depth with it. My favorite moment of the film has to be when Natasha and Taskmaster are fighting after destroying the Red Room. I loved how they landed on debris of the Red Room to try to break their fall. I give this movie a 7 out of 10, giving it a C. Anyway, that's the review. Go down to those comments and tell me what you thought. And click that like and subscribe button to keep up to date with all my latest content. See ya.